It's been a productive night. So welcome to Petra Fine. I was driving behind someone up the mountain who was driving so badly at one point I audibly gasped because I thought they were gonna crash into a car. Like, what is wrong with people? It's seven o'clock in the morning, get your act together. Oh, I do not wanna be awake. So I'm about to get a haircut. My hair is way too long. I meant to get it done every eight weeks and it's been 12. But you know, sometimes you win some, you lose some, at least I'm here. Um, haircuts stress me out to absolutely no point, so it's lucky that I'm just not bald. So let's hope it just looks like hair when we're done. I now have no hair. Look at that. Wow. I just realised I left my coffee in the microwave. I never drank it. It'll still be right, right? If I get food poisoning, that's on me. Hey, Beth. I just don't want to do it anymore. Same. Yeah. Um, what are, what are you doing? If you could just explain it to everyone. What are you, what are you got Welcome! going Welcome! I'm making salami pasta. So we've got boiling Which water. Is... And to the boiling water, you add too much pasta for two people. Step one. Uh, step two is get too much salami by accident, but then make it a recurring thing into little pieces. We cut it. And then... We add the too much salami to the too much pasta, a bit of garlic, maybe some spinach if we're feeling healthy. But the key is to cook it at 4 p.m. so that you don't have to get out of bed later to do dinner. Eat early, go to sleep. My favorite thing about salami pasta is it doesn't have like a combined flavor. Like it's just a, just a bowl of ingredients. I keep complaining that there's not enough hours in the day, but it would help if I didn't just sleep all the time. So, um, new hair look. So it kind of got like the shorter length, but also like this, like a, a top top knot. Like it's like Teletubby chic. So welcome to Petra Fine.